Hey guys, I wanted to make this video for all the people out there suffering from acne. Yes, the dreaded acne, the pimples, the blackheads, all of that stuff. Then please stay tuned for the video. And all the people with beautiful skin, you guys can go ahead and leave. Let me first start off by telling you guys a bit of my background. So I first started getting acne at the age of 10 in the fifth grade. I remember like it was yesterday. I got like one big huge zit like right underneath my chin. And me, I was like so excited because I was like, I'm growing up. I'm growing up. I have, <laughs> I have like this zit. So I was really excited about my first zit. I don't know why, but I was. I've been suffering from acne ever since the age of 10 years old. And it's been a problem like throughout my entire life. I went to dermatologists. They gave me prescription medication. It didn't always work. Some of it did work for a little while, but then it stopped. When I say my face will break out, I would get like big, huge whiteheads like on my face. Like I would get like a big zit on my face. And I also get the blackheads. Now the blackheads generally come on my forehead and sometimes on my cheeks and on my chin. Well, I have been taking some medicine that the doctor prescribed for me. A lot of my acne had to do with um, food allergies, like anything with milk or cheese in it, I would definitely get like a lot of acne after like I ate it like the next day. Like I couldn't eat a bowl of cereal because like the next day uh, my face would like really just break out and I couldn't eat like a lot of milk products and you know dairy products i try i tend to stay away from that now because i know that's what breaks me out but i would get a lot of that cause from dairy products what my doctor prescribed for me was the minocylin and this is 100 mg's now this this works okay it works okay um it's very expensive it depends on where you get it from but um it's very expensive and you can't take it forever they say you're only supposed to take this for about three months so after three months you can't take it anymore because your body gets immune to it so i was like you know okay that's great but you know is it going to work and another side effect with this is um for me it actually makes me gain weight so i didn't really like taking this and Another thing that broke me out a lot were vitamins. I know some people can take vitamins and you know their skin will be okay But those people usually have like nice skin so it won't like affect them Since I am allergic to almost everything. I have a lot of food allergies I used to take the GNC uh, women's ultra active. I used to take this And I would take this for energy and also it was supposed to be great with helping your hair grow out and at the time I wanted to grow my hair out really fast so I was taking this and then I was taking biotins I was taking this first and this absolutely broke my face out my face I got really bad uh, acne and I also got blackheads from this so I tend to stop taking this so then because my channel is really dedicated to hair growth. So I wanted to take um, the biotin. I took that for a week and it made my face break out so bad. Like it wasn't even funny. It just broke me out so bad. I absolutely hated it. So I stopped taking that. So I had been hearing about um, apple cider vinegar as a toner which i do use apple cider vinegar as a toner now with me i use mine straight out the bottle i just take a regular cotton ball and i'll just shake it onto the um the bottle of the apple cider vinegar and i'll put that on my face and it works amazing as a toner it really helps your acne to um gradually gradually um fading become smaller as a toner so it's really great as a toner it helps even out your complexion you know i can't really say enough about that oh so i had got a magazine and i'm just telling you guys how i looked up on um the apple cider vinegar peels because i knew it was great as a toner but 
I didn't know that you could also take it. So I was sent a magazine, supplement magazine, from this company that I get my hair oils from, and it was the Swanson uh, Vitamins. So I looked on the back of it and I saw some apple cider vinegar pills and I was like, hey, you know, I didn't know that, you know, you could actually take it. So I was like, okay, well, you know, let me do my research. So I looked up apple cider vinegar and acne, apple cider vinegar pills and acne. I looked that up and um, I didn't really see much on it because a lot of people were taking the apple cider vinegar teaspoon or two teaspoons then add it with some water and drink it like that I unfortunately I couldn't take it like that because it would burn, burn my throat my throat would get so burnt from taking that I didn't want to take it so I went ahead and I ordered the apple cider vinegar pills and this is the double strength and you guys this was only um, it was only it was less than two dollars I think it was like a dollar seventy nine I'm not sure on that but it was a dollar seventy nine so I was like you know okay I'll try it it's a dollar seventy nine it's super cheap I wasn't expecting it to work at all with my acne because I've tried some high-end products I've been using prescription medicine you know the majority of my life to help with the acne so I didn't think that something that costs two bucks, well less than two bucks, and you get 120 of them. I didn't think that it would work. I mean, I'm a skeptical person, so unless I do it and I see a change from it, then I'm like, hey, you know, I don't believe what it. I don't believe the hype. And this is 200 mg's. It's 200 mg's. I started taking it a month ago within the first week I could really see a difference it was you know and I'm not getting paid to do this video so I don't want you guys to think that I'm doing like an infomercial because this is not this video is to purely help somebody that's suffering from acne because you know you guys we all suffer from acne they wouldn't be showing those proactive commercials all the time if people did not suffer from acne so you guys you're not alone I suffer from acne and I suffer from all that stuff and I also suffer from eczema I'm taking this within the first week you guys I mean this was amazing like I could really tell like a difference in my skin my complexion was getting more even within the first week my pimples were starting to fade they were gradually going down and I was like well you know that's great but is it going to continue to work and at the time I stopped taking my mino silent I stopped taking this because I wanted to to see on its own was this going to work so within that first week like I said my face was a whole lot clearer and it was just amazing the next week came around and it just became even more clear until now and this is like a month later um, after taking the pills because I like to try out a product I don't like to come on here and say hey you know it worked good for the first week and I'm just hooked you know because the next week it might not be like that but this actually worked it also helped my eczema as well I would have dry patches and if you guys suffer from uh, eczema, then you know what I'm talking about. I have dry patches around, like, basically any opening in my face, any where that moisture can come out. So my eye, would, uh, I would have dry patches right here, and I would get eczema on my nose. Around my nostrils, it'll just peel. And also around my mouth, my face would just totally peel with these apple cider vinegar I have not had that problem I will also get I wouldn't break out on my chest as much as I break out on my face I would say like I would get like one one pimple on my chest um and this is probably the only part other than my face that I would uh, get a pimple I would get a pimple like let's say right here like every two three months I would get like one pimple so it wasn't that bad but it's like flat now like my skin is I mean it's just 
it's amazing i wish there was more videos out there that's why the sole purpose of this video was to help somebody that's out there and may not know about you know a natural remedy that actually works because of course the pharmaceutical companies and they want you to buy their prescription and yes their prescriptions do work but they're a expensive and b are they going to continue to work or will it be like this and after a couple months i can't take it anymore because i'm immune to it now the way i take my apple cider vinegar pills or vitamins whatever you want to call them i take one once a day i take it right when i get up in the morning time i take one pill and you can take this with food because it does tend to turn the vinegar does tend to turn your stomach the apple cider vinegar kills bacteria and it'll shrink the pimple so that's what you want and it's working from the inside out so like i said before i was using it as a toner which was great but i was working from the outside i was not working from the inside and from the inside it's much better because it'll target the bacteria kill the bacteria that's going to form a pimple and so that is great you can take it you can drink it with water and it's probably better if you uh if you can stomach it then i would say take it with water or take two teaspoons a day i think that's right if you can stomach it like that i unfortunately couldn't so that's why i am taking the pills but the pills are working awesome for me i hope this video was helpful please subscribe to my channel thanks for all the people that's already subscribed to me really hope this video will help some some of you guys out there that's suffering from acne you want something that'll work this is a great this is great for you Thanks so much for watching and uh, God bless. Bye.